locomotion hydras twist on or perform movements to change their location either in response to stimulus or to obtain food as gastrodermal muscle fibers are less developed movements are largely due to contraction of the epidermal muscle fibers hydra shows movements of the following types expansion and contraction hydra attached to a substratum in water frequently expands and contracts itself at intervals this behavior of hydra is called contraction burst it is initiated by a pacemaker located near the base of hypostome these movements helps to bring food organisms in contact with tentacles which are waved all around in water also contraction of one side and elongation of other side of body or tentacles result in the bending and swaying movements which assist in the capture of prey looping hydra moves one plus to another in search of food generally the body first extend and then bends over so that the tentacles attach to the substratum with the help of adhesive glutinant nematocyst then the pedal disc detached from substratum and brought up closer to crown of tentacles and then attached now tentacles loosen and body becomes erect again the whole process which is repeated often time and appears like a series of looping movements of a caterpillar somersaulting hydra somersault like a gymnast the tentacular end is brought forward and attached to this substratum the pedal disc moved upwards thus causing hydra to an inverted posture now pedal disc is moved forward and attached to a new position by freeing the tentacles and the again animal assume its upright position the animal perform a series of somersault by repeating the process gliding for a short distance alongside a smooth surface it slides down on its basal disc like a snail or amoeba secretion from mucus gland helps to lubricate the surface walking sometimes hydra becomes inverted set on its tentacles and moves in an inverted condition using its tentacle like legs this type of movement takes place on some object such as leaf and in relaxed condition climbing hydra other than vulgaris can show climbing by attaching its long tentacles to some object releasing the food and then contracting the tentacles so that the body is lifted up while changing location in limited area floating rarely hydra shows free and floats on water surface with waves sometimes hydra attaches to a floating leaf or twig by its pedal disc surfacing sometimes hydra uses a gas bubble secreted in mucus by the cells of pedal disc to rise in water and float at the surface if gas bubble burst the mucus thread sustain the body on water surface due to surface tension swimming it is said that sometime hydra frees itself from substratum and swims in water by undulating wave like movement of tentacles and body